There is a stupid stigma going around with the first game of a franchise to where it's apparently immune to all criticism. It mainly comes from Pokemon fans because it always, it always comes from Pokemon fans. They legitimately cannot take criticism. It's mainly Nintendo fans. They don't know how to take criticism whatsoever. They think it's an attack on themselves and they start like, sucking so much dick. I'm a person who's in like the music sphere, the like movie review sphere, like the critique sphere. That's my sort of cup of tea. And I love it because they are very brutal. They are very honest with their opinions on things. They take a project and they see if it's like, if it holds up to a certain standard. And with games nowadays, people are like so scared to say it's a product of its time. Pokemon fans, it's okay. You can let go of red and blue. It's not, they're not good games. Just because they started a franchise doesn't mean they were good games. It's a product of its time. Sure, in the 19 whatever the fuck, it was like, I don't know if it was even good during that time period. I just think people flocked to it. But yeah, it was good in a certain time period. But the thing is, it didn't age well. There's a fuck ton of glitches. There's, the art style is kind of whatever. It's in black and white, like, I'm sorry, there's not much holding this game to a certain standard. You can't just say, oh, well, it's, it started the franchise, well, <laughs> I don't give a single fuck if that started the franchise. You can call it out for what it is, a bad game. It's like going back to an artist's old work, like someone like <laughs> Post Malone. That's like going back to Post Malone's first records, first, like, music he's ever dropped in his entire life and saying, oh, well, you gotta respect it because that's how he started. He got big. Like, no, what the fuck? If a song is ass, a song is ass. If a game is ass, a game is ass. It doesn't matter if it started like a legacy. It's still a shit game. Gamers seem so scared to form an opinion for themselves because of the backlash that comes from it. But in reality, if you go into like, I don't know, normal spheres like music or movie, Nobody gives a fuck about the backlash. You know what happens in the music sphere when someone calls, I don't know, a song I like bad? I call them fucking stupid and I move on. <laughs> hey yo, that's kind of crazy you have a different opinion than me, but I don't really give a shit and I still like the song regardless. It doesn't matter. But you know, perspective is actually amazing. Why can't people do that anymore? Like, holy fuck. Fucking shit. You can respect an opinion or you cannot respect an opinion and just like, I don't know, move on with your fucking life. I think it's because a lot of people see like one person as representing many, but that's not really the case at all. It's basically like one person is representing one person. <laughs> and when you break it down into that and allow more perspective in your life, you can be like, wow, I disagree with your take, but you know, you can have your own opinion. That's literally why is life so hard? <laughs> People have this weird attachment to things they shouldn't have attachments to, and then they become hostile when you actually critique it and say not too nice things about it. It's literally peak cinema! It's literally peak cinema! Oh my god, Pokemon! They done it again! I don't know if a lot of people remember this, but the Undertale days when someone would play the game, I don't know how they wanted to play the game, Fans would get so angry, holy shit. There was instances to where people would like, dox the fuck out of you and also just like, track you down. It was that bad when you killed like, Toriel. Undertale fans would have hated if I played that game because holy shit, I would have done some of the dumbest shit and I don't give a fuck. I'm playing through it, I'm gonna play it my way if I wanna kill Toriel, I'm gonna kill Toriel. You're gonna stay mad, argue with your dog, ARGUE WITH YOUR DOG! She's like, wow, oh, you're upset because I didn't play the game how 90% of these other people played it? Wow, shut the fuck up. Tell me you're gonna harm me just because I killed a fucking video game character. Shut the fuck up talking to me, bro. <laughs> hey, 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 shh, 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 shh. I didn't forget, I didn't forget. How's it going, pups? It's a canine.